Good morning, Miss Grimmel. Morning, Gabriel. I hope you haven't lost any sleep over this morning's assessment. One might imagine that some of you had been up all night. No point in beating about the holly bush, eh, Mildred? What potion are you two up to in your book? Elementary mineralization. That's turning to rock for the rest of you. Would you and Drusilla like to give me a demonstration? We'll do our best. But we've only been doing it since this morning. Really? So we're a bit unsure. Miss Gribble tried to explain, but we couldn't really grasp it. Well, just take a sip and we'll see. There's nothing to laugh at. Is that you, Ethel and Drusilla? <laughs> yes, well, I suppose there were a few rocks in the bottom of the fishbowl. If this is all Ethel and Drusilla have managed this week, it's really not worth asking anyone else. Well, they do seem confident. Ruby Cherry Tree, perhaps. I would rather take someone less keen to have a go, Miss Gribble. Mildred Hubble, what would you like to show us? Another prickly evergreen? No, Miss Harbury. I've been trying aqua crystallography. Oh, ice magic, Mildred. If anyone ever manages to get that into your muddled head, they'll be the best potions teacher on the planet. What are you really up to? Crystal ice magic, Miss Harbury. Well, Miss Cackle, perhaps we should put a cloth down to catch the drips. <laughs> oh, well, don't worry, Mildred. Fire away. We'll save you. Just do your best, dear. Anything's possible, Miss Harbury. Except the impossible, Miss Cackle. You have found a place in all our hearts and a seat at the staff room table, which we'd like you to take with you to remember us by, along with a little something from the third year. My own work as well. I hope it doesn't dribble. <laughs> 